called space time. Hey everybody, today I'm showing one of the coolest toys that I've gotten my hands on recently. This is a plasma toroid. Actually, it's a very simple physics toy that excites these gases. This particular one is xenon, but you can also try it with other mixtures. So the way it works is you put this there, you turn it on, and it creates this cool effect. It is also Bluetooth compatible, so you can actually play music. You can change this by playing around with that. Very simple design, very cool toy. As you can see, the body here is 3D printed. Uh, you're not supposed to touch that, so you want to be careful. This is not a toy. When I say physics toy, it's for educational purposes. You want it to be supervised if you want to have little kids around so they don't touch anything that would burn them or hurt them. This is now connected. To make groundbreaking discoveries. Those discoveries are then published in the very book you originally took back in time. The Paradox. Fermi's Paradox grapples with the high probability of extraterrestrial civilizations existing in the universe and the lack of evidence or contact with such civilizations. How do we explain this? The traditional zoo hypothesis suggests that extraterrestrial civilizations are aware of us, but choose not to contact us, treating Earth like a nature reserve or a zoo. Designed the simulation so that contact with extraterrestrial life does not occur to maintain the integrity of their experiment or narrative. You can see there's a fan here to keep it cool. These do tend to get warm after a while. 